so i found this package manager and i thought this is worth sharing with my viewers so this pnpm is a brother of npm package manager but this is an advanced brother of npm so in this video i am going to explain how exactly this pnpm is better than npm and how you can use it to make your applications much faster Hey everyone, I'm Kamran and I'm a Bullstack web developer and a blockchain developer. And on my channel, I usually create videos on JavaScript and blockchain. So if you are new here, I will suggest you to hit the subscribe button and hit the like button as well. So it will help me to grow as a YouTuber. You know how YouTube algorithm works. Yeah, back to the topic. So here I found this package manager name as PNPM, which is much faster than our node package manager. So first of all, for those who are new to web development and JavaScript frameworks, I would like to explain what exactly is NPM. So NPM stands for node package manager. So when whenever you are using node or any JavaScript framework, you have this NPM where you can get the different packages of JavaScript. When you create a new application in the node, so you get this package JSON in your node application and in that node package JSON you have all your dependencies and these dependencies point out to the node package manager from where your code base downloads all the packages needed for your code base. And this whole system is managed by the node package manager. But what is the issue with this node package? The biggest issue in this node package manager is that it always becomes too large for your code base. So let's say if you have 10 dependencies and each of the 10 dependencies have interdependencies on some other modules. So that will grow exponentially. So your node module where your all package dependencies are kept in your code base grew a lot. Sometimes it becomes in GBs. So what is the main issue behind growing this node module this much? In the NPM, we have this issue of duplicacy of the dependencies. So if you have three of your dependency have some dependencies on same package, then it will have the duplicate package of that inside each of your deep dependencies. So how exactly this PNPM solves this issue? So if, let's say if, if your two deep different dependency have the requirement of a module or a package, so what it will do, it will download for one and it will create an alias for that module and share it with the other all dependency where it will be reused. So instead of having a multiple downloaded package, there will be only one package and then package reference will be used in all other packages. So there will not be duplicate packages in your node module. It will reduce the size of that node module. You can try this PNPM in next time in your project to make your whole project faster. So I will share this link in the description. You can try it out. So installation guide and everything is available here. And this is very much similar to NPM. So whoever is you already using NPM will not get confused how to use this. Thanks everyone for watching the whole video. I would like to suggest you to hit the subscribe button and the like button down there. And please do share this with every JavaScript developer so that it can help other developers to make their project faster. Thanks everyone. Happy coding everyone.